the tip test. You hit up Jellies for a snack. Your waitress mistakes you for someone who looks like you, black, who once ran up a $30 bill and left a dollar tip. You watch all the other customers order before you do. Pastrami sandwich on rye. And then proceed to wait no less than 40 minutes for your food. How do you tip? A. 40 minutes? She's lucky if she gets 40 cents. Okay, you do a good job, maybe see a tip. B. <laughs> she was tripping, but 15% is the least I can do. Or C. I reject the stereotype that African Americans do not tip. I will leave 20, no 25, just to prove that I can. One hundred oof the no show. Dear white people, in a shocking reversal, using the term African American is borderline racist now. It turns out if you're too worried about political correctness to say black, odds are you secretly just want to call us niggers anyway. And truth be told, I'd rather you be honest about it. Free speech, my ass. Oh, Stalin quotes for 200, please? Are you joking about this? Oh, I'm sorry. Was I supposed to take free speech, my ass, as a legitimate suggestion? This is your office's issue, Walter, especially after that episode with Kurt in the dining hall. Oh, all race issues are my issues. This is a student issue. And you are the dean of students, aren't you? The last thing we need is race war in the papers across this country. How do you think the donor base will feel about that? The fundraiser is four weeks away. How bad is this deficit of yours? It's worse. But I want to make something really clear. If this gets any bigger at all, it's on you, Walter. Racism is over in America. <laughs> the only people who are thinking about it are I don't know, Mexicans, probably.